What'll it be? Uh, I'll take a draft, Lisa, please. One draft coming up. Thanks. Let's just drop it, okay? Jonah, what am I supposed to tell Abe? He's gonna wonder why you're not spending Christmas with us. You wanna know the reason why I don't wanna spend Christmas with you and Abe? I'll tell you. Hey, little brother. How you doing? Fine, Abe. What's going on? I tracked you down. There's something I want to talk to you about. What do you want to talk to me about? There's something going on between you and Lexi. Go over here and sit and talk. Come on. So, you want to tell me something that's going on between Lexi and me? I've seen it, Jonah. I've tried to ignore it, but when I see the two of you together, it's obvious. And I can't ignore it any longer. Ignore what? Jonah, I have seen the looks, the vibes, the tension. Abe, it's, it's not Lexi's fault. She's, I mean, she's not having the problem anymore. Abe, it's me. I'm still having the problem. Oh, well, what I've seen, that's obvious. Lexi tries to reach out to you, and you slam the door in her face. What? Jonah, why do you refuse to come to Christmas dinner? Christmas dinner. Excuse me, Commander Carver, you have a phone call. Oh, thank you, Lisa, thank you. Don't you go anywhere. We're not through with this. Yeah, Commander Carver here. Yeah. All right, thank you. Someone has smashed a department store Christmas window display. Oh, no. First the Christmas tree burning in Salem Place, and then this? What's going on? I don't know. I don't know. Jonah, I want you to think about changing your mind about Christmas dinner. Now, I, I know that you and Lexi are both strong-willed, and you butt heads a lot. You know, it means so much to me to have you there. I know. Good. And please, please just put aside your differences with Lexi and make it a happy holiday for me, huh? Abe, I gotta, I gotta go. Um, Jonah, I'll, I'll talk to you later, okay?